I'm hoping that it's it's all right. It kind of have that um flower kind of smell too, though. Like I don't know. What's up, my grub lovers? You ready to get that grub on? You know that I am. It's your boy, Mr. Grub, back again with another video for you guys. And today, I was really contemplating, you know, stopping somewhere. I had, a, you know, a taste for some hot, man. So I was going to stop somewhere and get me some hot food. But I was like, you know what? I was rushing a little bit. So I was like, well, we'll just eat me some cereal. You know what I'm saying? But I was like, I, there was no way I was going to have time to do all of that at home, right? So I was like, I'm going to do it in the car. So I prepared myself today. You guys see, I got my milk. You know what I'm saying? I got my bowl. I got my big ass spoon. Y'all know I can't go nowhere without this, man. You know what I'm saying? This is my everyday cereal eating spoon, okay? Can't go nowhere without that. And of course, this new cereal I want to try from Post. Okay, so Post has a new cereal called Donuts, and it's really like powdered donuts. And the funny thing about it is, when I first grabbed these donuts, man, I'm gonna tell you the funny thing about it. The first thing that came to my head was um, how we used to play with powdered donuts back in the days. So I don't know if some of you guys remember back in the days, you used to have the bubblegum cigarette. And, and I think about it now and I'm like, that was such a poor choice for kids. They came out with a bubble gum, right? And it was in the shape of a cigarette. And what they would do is you could put the, the gum to your mouth and you, instead of sucking in, you blow out. And when you blow out, smoke, or I guess you could say the powdered sugar that was on it would come out. So it literally looked like you were smoking. And uh, I got to find it. If I find it for you guys, I'm going to show it to you. But back then we thought it was cool because on all the movies there was everybody smoked you know what i'm saying so we felt like you know we we, we like everybody else we're grown-ups it wasn't more so about being cool or anything like that it was about you know being an adult everybody wanted to rush to grow up when you were a kid you know what i'm saying you want to drive early you want to cook you want to do everything uh but you didn't want to do responsibilities as a kid you didn't want to clean up you didn't make your bed and all that stuff you want to skip all that and go straight to the adult right so it was the same thing with powdered donuts, man, right? Like, so you got your gum, you doing your cigarette. With a powdered donuts, you take a little bit of the powder, and you, you know, you put it down or whatever, like flour. You put it down, because you used to see on some of the movies, as we got older, some of the movies, they was doing like, you know, the little Coke or whatever. So you take the little powdered donut, and you get a little powder, you like put it right here. And it is funny because it was innocent back then. You know what I'm saying? We weren't really like... We didn't know what it was. We didn't know, you know, what, what cocaine was or powder. We didn't know about none of that stuff, right? We just knew that when you watch the movie, like Scarface or something like that, you see powder on the face, they was cool. You know, people looked up to them. You know what I'm saying? Like, man, you know what I'm saying? Look at this right here. You know what I'm saying? Got me a little powder, you know? And it was funny back then. And of course, like I said, you, you don't really see things for what they really are until you look at it from the outside. So growing up, you know, it was, we were living it. We were in the moment, you know what I'm saying? But now I'm looking at it like, man, I was crazy. I would never do that. I would never show my kids that or, or give them the impression that that's cool and stuff like that. So it just it just popped up in my head, though, when I saw the donuts, because I'm like, they've, you know, we've come so far in life, but we still circle back. And a lot of people don't realize how, but we circle back all the time. So I haven't had a powdered donut since I was a kid, okay? And to see that they, they've now come to the point where they turn them into cereal, I'm interested. I really am interested. So I'm not going to play with it and put it all on my nose and all that, but I'm definitely going to try it out. And I'm going to try it out with you guys because, you know, that's what I do, right? So I'm going to open this up. <laughs> it smells like powder dough does too. I just don't know. I mean, powdered donut and cereal. I, I don't know. But then again, guess what? The chicken and waffles was good, so I can't put nothing past it. You know what I'm saying? Open up milk. Of 
Tapos, my baby. So yeah, let's see that. We're gonna try this out. See how this really is. Okay, I'm hoping that it's it's all right. It kind of have that um flower kind of smell too, though. Like I don't know. Okay, I don't really think it's a powdered donut though. It don't taste like a powdered donut unless I don't remember how to taste it. So, it don't really taste like a powdered donut to me. I kind of don't really know what it tastes like. It is a unique flavor, though. I, I can't put my finger on it. What exactly it tastes like. Um, out of my choices, though, I probably wouldn't choose to eat this one only because... Even though it's a unique flavor, it's not one that I'm keen to really enjoy. But, you know, shout out to Post for, for thinking outside of the box, man. You know what I'm saying? I think a lot of people are willing to try things um, just because of the innovation and just because of the idea of man I didn't think of that you know what I'm saying so shout out to Post for that definitely an acquiring taste so I just don't know I can't put my finger on this taste man and it's bothering me because I don't know what to say this tastes like uh, it's kind of like a cake almost like a cake flavor like a plain vanilla cake that's what it tastes like like a vanilla cake that's exactly what it tastes like so if you guys are familiar with vanilla cake that's what it tastes like like I said so vanilla cake is one of those cakes you can eat it but you probably wouldn't go and just say give me a vanilla cake you know what I'm saying but if somebody had if somebody actually had vanilla cake, you'd be like, oh, I eat it, you know? That's kind of that's kind of what it is. Anyway, shout out to Postman. Like I said, you guys, if you're in the store, you're willing to try, man, get these donuts, man. These donut cereal. You know what I mean? If you're a big powder donut fan, uh, don't do it because it's not going to taste exactly like powder donut. But if you want to try something different, man, and you're interested in trying new things, this is definitely the cereal for you, okay? I'm going to go ahead and finish mine up, man, so I can get to work. I'll get back with you guys later. If you're new to the channel, man, don't forget to like and subscribe. Comment below. Let me know what's your favorite cereal or your favorite childhood memory like mine. Until next time, you guys, it's your boy, Mr. Grub. I'm out.